Welcome to Buena Pop again. As you can see, a very special American event is coming. It's the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl, it's a big, big, big sport event here in the United States. Being Italian, I can compare it with the last match of the uh, World Soccer Cup. I mean, a big event that even if you're not into that particular sport, you just watch it. Everybody comes, you watch the game, even if you do not even know the names of the teams, because it's, it's just fine. It's just, you know, family and friends time. Usually for the Super Bowl, everybody is just watching TV. So everybody is in front of the screen. That's why usually we serve finger foods. But as we have kids in the house, we do not want to serve junk food. So today's recipe is dedicated to the Super Bowl, it is baked chicken strips with a very nice sweet onion dip that can be used for the chicken or if you've got you know a nice plate of raw vegetables you can just dip the vegetables in the sweet onion dip and trust me it's delicious and it's healthy it's homemade let's start together from the ingredients i'm using one full breast chicken one cup one cup and a half of breadcrumbs and today i use two different kinds the normal breadcrumbs and the panko ones the panko breadcrumbs is a kind of Japanese style breadcrumbs that basically has kind of big chunks of bread inside. I'm using a nice half a cup of grated parmesan cheese, a mix of fresh herbs from the garden, rosemary, thyme and sage that as you can see I already minced, some salt if you want, some extra virgin olive oil and some milk. Those are the ingredients that we will need for the chicken. For our nice sweet onions dip, we're going to use onions, of course, one medium-sized sweet yellow onion, two, three tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, two tablespoons of cider vinegar, other two tablespoons of agave or honey, honey will work perfectly, one tablespoon of mustard. This time I'm going to use the mustard, the plain mustard without grains, one cup of mayonnaise. So try to find, you know, the real mayonnaise, the one done with eggs. A good quality one will be perfect. Let's start together our recipe. What I did previously. So yesterday I cut my nice chicken breast in strips, in slices, tiny ones. And as you can see, I put my chicken in the fridge and it was covered with milk, whole milk or 2% low-fat milk, any kind of milk will work because <laughs> this is a suggestion that comes from a very close friend of mine. Thank you, Yvette. She suggested to marinate the chicken in the milk overnight so that the chicken will be very, very tender and moistured, so perfect for our kids and for us too. <laughs> so our chicken is nicely marinated in milk and here I'm going to put together the breadcrumbs and I'm going to add the parmesan cheese, the nice herbs. As I said, it's rosemary, thyme and sage. If you want, you can just add a pinch of salt and just mix everything together. I preheated the oven at 425 degrees. The oven is warm. I will just put a tiny, tiny layer of oil on the parchment paper, and then I'm going to prepare my chicken strips. I'm going basically to put my chicken strips in the bread in the breadcrumb mix and I'm going to place them in a nice oven tray. As you can see, I didn't use any egg, just the milk in order to let the, the, the breadcrumbs mix attach to, to my chicken because I think it's lighter. You can always use some eggs, you know, you can just, you know, some eggs and you can put you know the chicken from the milk to the eggs to the breadcrumbs and we'll add one layer of crust but i want to this is a kind of you know light kids friendly version so i prefer to do it without eggs 
Here we are five minutes later, our tray is nicely full with our chicken strips. So last touch, just a light drizzle of extra virgin olive oil on top and our chicken is ready to go in the oven. So the oven is ready at 425 and I will cook our chicken. I mean, it's it, they're kind of tiny strips, so it doesn't require a lot of time. For 10 minutes on each side. So after 10 minutes, I will take it out, I will turn my chicken strips and then I will put them back for another 10 minutes. Total of 20 minutes and you have to see that a nice kind of golden crust will be formed on top. So see you later for the final result. Our chicken is cooking and meanwhile we are going to prepare together our dip. Amazing sweet onion dip. What I did previously I took our nice medium onion and I caramelized it. So I sliced the onion, I took a nice pan, I put some extra virgin olive oil in the pan and at medium heat, I started cooking the onions. When they are caramelized, it means that they're kind of brown and very cooked, very soft. So it took me like 10, 15 minutes. When the onion got that kind of golden brown color, I reduced the heat at low heat so that they could keep cooking without burning. That's the final result, see? <laughs> Yummy. So we are going to put our onions in a mixer. Then we are going to add one tablespoon of mustard, two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, other two tablespoons of agave. Agave to give a kind of sweet, sour, sweet taste. And you can use either agave or honey. It works perfectly. Last touch, some mayo. One cup of mayo. And of course, this dip, it's either for mommy and daddy and their friends or for all their kids. Let's mix everything together. Done. Mmm. Let me check. Mmm, yummy. Yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> so, our dip is ready. Our chicken is cooking. So, see you together in a few minutes in order to see the final result. And remember, after 10 minutes, turn the chicken in the oven. So, a nice crust will be formed on both sides. So, see you later. <laughs> Bye. Ciao. 20 minutes later, our baked chicken strips are ready to be tasted from the whole party. <laughs> Look at them. They are crispy, they are tender inside, and they are very, very, very yummy. <laughs> the crust is delicious. And with the dip, oh wow, it's wonderful. <laughs> I hope you're going to enjoy your Super Bowl party, as we will, and we're going to see you next week with another recipe from Buona Papa, and as always, Buona Papa Tutti! Ciao!